smashing and crashing, there is an angry boy. A giant who just wants to be left alone. But should he get dirty, there is little that can stop his wrath. In his blind rage, he'll destroy cities, kill thousands, but he'll still protect the world and save the shower. He is a mean, green, fighting machine, and his name is Scrub Smash. Yeah, oh man! Welcome to the Frick Cast and to the Dr. Squatch Limited Soap Guides. Today, we're absorbing gamma radiation with a Scrub Smash. This is a part of the Avenger Collection, a collab between Dr. Squatch and Marvel. It is of course the Hulk edition, but is this pissed off bar just throwing a tantrum? Or is it an unlikely hero? Well let's get into this indestructible brick. We'll begin with the unique ingredients, the highlighted being Gamma Amino Acid, also known as GABA. Now we actually just saw this in a more recent release, the Bliss Brick. This is an anti-aging ingredient that smooths skin, boosts collagen production, and improves elasticity. It is also used to reduce anxiety. Next we have All Heal Extract. Now I wasn't sure what exactly this was, since Squash decided to stop listing what the unique ingredients actually are. Instead, they just put the nicknames on there. So shout out to Evan2255's Avenger Review, because thanks to him showing what I believe is the Canadian boxes, which not only have a lot more things listed, but actually list the real names of the ingredients, I was able to find out exactly what the unique ingredients are for the Scrub Smash and the other Avenger bricks. So go check out his channel if you want some more quality reviews. But yeah, it's Valerian Root, which again is another relaxing ingredient used against anxiety and insomnia. It protects as well as soothes and smooths skin. It's also an anti-inflammatory ingredient that helps against minor skin irritations and has calming properties. There is also green rhyolite, which is of course going to give us our grit, in this case a heavy level of grit. Rhyolite is a porous volcanic rock often used in squash bricks, similar to pumice. It's going to provide that extra exfoliation, clearing away dead skin and impurities, as well as allow the bar to clean deeper. Overall, we have a pretty promising bar with some really beneficial ingredients, including ones with relaxing qualities that can calm even the angriest Hulk. But let's look a bit deeper before we decide if we should scrub smash or pass. Now the scent is going to be its most polarizing quality. I'll be honest, when I first got the bar I was prepared to rank it in the bottom tier, as I was not a fan of the spicy cucumber scent. It literally smelled like a spicy cucumber or a spicy pickle, and it's not very pleasant. However, this all changed when I actually used the bar in the shower, as the spicy sour notes basically all but disappeared, giving way to a fresh cucumber scent that was quite pleasant. It kind of reminded me of the legendary lather, but instead of grass, it was cucumber. It's a really refreshing and surprisingly peaceful scent. I went from hating it in the box to liking it a good bit in the shower. It kind of reminds me of like a cucumber cocktail. It's also easily the strongest scent of the Avenger collection, which wasn't necessarily great at first, but that potency is certainly nice when it's actually used and the better notes come out. It's not going to be a scent for everybody, but if you ever want it to smell like the Hulk's spicy cucumber, then here you go. The clean of this bar also shines in the shower. The grit feels nice and consistent. It's more medium than heavy, but it's a nice amount in my opinion. It feels deep cleaning, moisturizing, and restorative as well. Coupled with the scent, and you have a brick that feels very refreshing to use. It's similar to the Bliss brick, in that it seems to also try to relax you, and in that regard it's a pretty chill brick. The ingredients shine here, and with the power of this bar's clean, you'll be telling the captain, I'm always clean. As for my thoughts, I like the Scrub Smash a lot more than I thought I would, and as such, I think I'm going to put it as a, this brick be bussin' for now. I'm going to put it between the Irish Cream and Whiskey and the Bliss Brick. The scent turned from one of the worst 
to a really nice one once it opened up. A fresh cucumber smell that has some strength to it. The more medium grit feels good and consistent, and the bar overall feels great to use. The ingredients fit the Hulk, even if the Hulk is my least favorite character from the collection. I also like their green color, even if it's maybe not the most natural looking. Overall, it's a refreshing, deep cleaning brick that may not leave a good first impression, but that's why you can never judge a brick by its cover. That's only my opinion though, and I'd love to hear yours in the comments. What do you think of the Hulk Boy and the Adventure Collection as a whole? Let me know if you get your hands on this Angie Brick. While he's slamming through everything in his path, it's easy to see this bar as a villain. But once given a chance, you may just find yourself liking this brick when it's angry.